Things had calmed down in Bongo Congo. With Itchy Brother and Biggie Rat, those infamous villains out of the way, peace descended on Bongo Congo. King Leonardo settled down to handling affairs of state, aided by his faithful companion, Odi O'Coloni. This particular morning, the king was engrossed in the Royal Post Office Department when Odi entered excitedly. Ah, a rare specimen. A triangle from Zanzaraco. Oh, what an addition to... Your my... Majesty! Your Majesty! Well, what is it? Can't you see I'm involved in serious affairs of state? Out with it, man! A very large packing case has arrived for you, sire. Well, bring it in! Bring it in! Well, it's finally come. All the way from the United States of America. Open it, True Blue Odie. Open it! Look at that, Odie. Look at that! What is that, sire? What is it? What is it? True Blue Odie, that's a genuine first class A number one go kart! Go kart, Majesty? Precisely. All the range in the States. Very fast, very exciting. Listen to this. Twin engine, dual carbs, speeds up to 70 miles an hour. Centrifugal clutch, V-belt Samus from, plus the famous variable Framish. Let's try it, right now. In the throne room, sire. Why not? Whose throne room is it, anyway? Let's go. I'll get in, then you pull that little cord. Here we go. Whoopee! Are you hurt, Your Highness? Hurt? Certainly not. Most fun I've had in years. Odie, this is the greatest gadget in the history of gadgetry. The peak product of American progress. Everyone in Bongo Congo must take up this sport. We'll have races, rallies, Jim Connors. I'll issue a proclamation. Take this down. And so it was that go-karts became the national pastime of Bongo Congo. Everyone was doing it. Young, old, men, women. Everyone was going cart happy. But meanwhile, in the remote mountain hideaway of those two arch villains, Itchy Brother and Biggie Rat. Hey, Big. <laughs> Dig my kooky brother driving a sewing machine. <laughs> it's like got me in stitches, man. <laughs> it says here he's entering a race with these go kart gadgets. First prize is 100,000 bongo bucks. <laughs> he must be like nuts. I mean, who but a nut with 100,000 bongo bucks? Now, let me see that. The king announces that he will enter the annual go-kart race at Indianapolis. Okay, King Z, we'll take you on. Yeah, but, uh, gee, Big, uh, we don't know anything about rolling uh, one of those kitty cars. And it says here, uh, my royal brother is like a pro, you know. Listen, Clutchhead, how many times do I have to tell you? You don't win by winning, you win by cheating. And nobody cheats better than Biggie, see? Yeah, okay, Big. I dig. Now, here's what we're going to do, see? And so it was that on the day of the big race, a new entry appeared. Number 77, driven by none other than Itchy Brother. The drivers are approaching the starting line, and just listen to that ovation for King Leonardo. A mighty popular figure, and the odds-on favorite to win. We understand he has a specially designed widget that delivers fantastic speed to his car. There, too, in the black car, is the infamous Itchy Brother, rival of the king. Wait, there's the starter, there's the gun, they're off! Who will win, King Leonardo or Itchy Brother? How does the Club of Biggie Rat plan to cheat Leonardo? Don't miss the next exciting episode, Rat Race.